So today I'm gonna to be reacting to Chill Kill by Red Velvet. And I'm especially excited to check out the song because I have produced and co-written a song on this record called Ice Coffee. Let's get right into it. The vibes are so good already. Oh, what is happening? I just like how spooky it is. It's so like Halloween, perfect for November. They're ready. <laughs> okay, I like the synth work here. Of course, the ad libs, the beautiful harmonies, we have to have them. Um, whenever, Liar, whenever we do any sort of remake of songs in the style of Red Velvet, we always do the pretty ad libs in the intro. <laughs> it looks stunning. I love the cinematography. I love the glides of the bass. This beat is so like nasty in the best way. <laughs> the harmony right there with the da 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 that melody. Yeah, 10 out of 10. I love these girls. <laughs> oh, woo, I love that. <laughs> Straight out of Liar, Liar's book. <laughs> oh, the chords right here. Nice build up, very K-pop, very SM. <gasps> that is so musical. The chord changes here, the complete beat change. It is so SM and you just don't hear a lot of songs like this anymore. Everything is so like TikTok core now and pop and K-pop like everywhere. It's not anybody's fault. It's just like the culture. This is so cool though. Oh, gorgeous. I love the looks too. They're kind of like simpler. Like that mauve kind of skirt looks more like cozy, not as like glitzy in your face K-pop, which it's nice. I like it. It's different for K-pop. It's different for them. Her tone, her vocal tone right there, so pretty. The air. I'm biased, of course, because that's how I sing. <laughs> I love her voice. Oh, love that slide. I, I'm just generally like a very big fan of these girls. Obviously, I have like a, an emotional tie to them. The very first K-pop song that I wrote was Talk To Me for them. Um, well, the first I wrote, but the first released so uh but i also just love the way they sing um you know they're great dancers too but i think the concept of their group is more focused on their vocals they're singing and i am way more of a singer than a dancer so for me this is like <laughs> closer to my heart pretty i want to know what the story is i can never tell in a lot of these videos so much is happening. There's that descending chord pattern. I like that. Yeah, it's very interesting musically right here. I already said it, but like, it's, it's hitting me again. <laughs> It's also very, the hook is so red velvet. Um, a lot of their traditional, traditional, <laughs> for the last several years, a lot of the hooks, like the catchy parts of their songs are very sim simple. Da, 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 da. That's a very like simple, catchy melody. So it's, it's like red velvet on the dot, really. <laughs> That's so SM. It reminds me of like NCT Dream, this type of bridge. Ooh. Oh, we've got a storytelling moment. 
That's beautiful. I love that this type of cinematography is so prevalent in K-pop right now. Three natural tones, darker uh, color coding or color grading, excuse me. <laughs> um, it looks really cool. This is a very 80s production, the uh, acoustic kick with the sort of poly synths in the background for <laughs> producers that are watching. It's cool. It's definitely not something I would have expected for the song, but very SM. <laughs> yeah, the vocal is, is right. I love that run on end, the word end. Oh, beautiful. <gasps> it's gotta be CGI. <laughs> they didn't set a house on fire. I hope not. <laughs> oh, the cops are coming for them. Shouldn't have set that house on fire. <laughs> the ad libs is good. <laughs> I think it's funny dancing in front of the cop cars. I love the color grading here, the dark, dark sky. Ooh. Mm. Very interesting. I'm not like fully picking up on the story, but I'm usually not like the best at that. So let me know in the comments what you think the story of the video signifies. Well, I'm super happy with this. I think the girls slayed and I'm so proud to have a song on this album. We actually wrote so, so many other songs for this album that weren't accepted, which one of them you can check out right here. It's called Gimme Love. I will see you guys next time. Bye.